This presentation will show how the RockWorks playlist can be used to automate volumetric computations for a dredging project. We'll start by defining the project dimensions. Next, the pre-dredging bathymetry data is imported into the RockWorks datasheet. A grid service is then interpolated to the pre-dredging bathymetry data. These depths range from 8 to 10 meters. This grid is then filtered to create an idealized post-dredging model with a depth of 16 meters. The pre- and post-dredging grid models are then used as filters to create a block model depicting the spoil or the material to be removed. Finally, the block model statistics are computed indicating that 122 million cubic meters of material must be removed to lower the harbor depth to 16 meters. Now if we want to quantify the materials that will be dredged, things become a little bit more complicated. Specifically, downhole lithology data is entered into the borehole manager database. From this borehole data, a lithology model is interpolated. And from this model, the individual lithology volumetrics are computed on a layer-by-layer -layer basis.